This is a Guilford Cape being delivered down a narrow lot onto 25 acres. We've already got the first half up there, so that was our test pilot down this road. Now we're going to try the second piece. So everybody's got their fingers crossed. I think I even got my toes crossed. Oh, I'm positive I have my toes crossed. Absolutely positive I have my toes crossed. I've been doing this for a long time. I, ne <laughs> I, ne I never am calm during the delivery phase. And of course my phone's ringing. When does it not ring? Uh, I'm in the middle of moving this house. No. All right, bye. Yeah, phone never stops ringing. Anyways, here we are. Back at it. See the house cat's on the front here. It's gonna swing it all the way across the road and then back up this driveway right here. If all goes well. Know what I said, if all goes well. that little tugboat, a little, little house cat, walking it up. When you bring it in backwards, you got more ability to wiggle it around than if you pull it in straight, because the axle is so far back in on the frame. Here it is. We've gotten through the most nasty part, actually. Once those axles right there get across this this raised ridge area and get up in there all's good you just got to get those axles up there and then we're good start to see that the most important tool in this whole company is the house cap. <laughs> Pin turn right here, gonna keep those axles straight going through there. There we go. That basically is it, folks. That's House Cat 101. <laughs> Stressful, but it's done. Talk to you later. Bye.